nice. And that was good. It was a lovely bit of water that you just, uh, was similar to where we'd pulled out a few fish before. And when something's working, you really should just keep doing it. And we'll get him back in here. Let's A bit of bend in that, get him into that net. Are very aggressive when they, they do see that. Get him in here and zing, a lovely little uh, rainbow again. And interesting, that sort of water was very similar to where we got the last few out of. So as we walked upstream, I could uh, literally see very similar water. It's got enough depth so that uh, the fish is going to be confident enough got enough flow to bring food to it um, and the water temperature is pretty good so it doesn't mind being in the sun so it's an ideal sort of uh, situation for it so we had a few quite a few casts there because the water is uh, quite cool they won't move too far so you really need to be putting that fly right in front of his nose or six inches either side as we get into summer then they'll be more aggressive uh, the metabolism changes and they feed a lot harder so they might go three foot to eat something you know, so uh, early on in the season, you've got to do a lot more casts in the right areas, and eventually, you come up trumps. Beautiful little fish. Great little net, too, that uh, you keep out of the way. And I always have it attached with a bungee cord, so that, you know, once you've netted the fish and got it out, you can let the net go, and it doesn't float off downstream. So, um, great little nets from McLean's. And it also has scales in the... Uh, uh, the handle as well, you can pull out. We might not need that for this uh, this one, but he's still a lovely fish just the same. Beautiful rainbow in a stunning river like this is just fantastic. And to get a few like that um, in a few hours is just a, a great way to, to spend a morning and you really enjoy it. And they are really just stunning fish. Nice and aggressive, beautiful colors just in a super environment and you just go, wow. How lucky we are in Australia to have access literally for free to an outstanding fishery and it's beautiful. So uh, pretty cool. So I hope you've enjoyed today's episode up in Northeast Victoria. There's plenty of rivers very similar to this one that you can go to or even some bigger ones like the Goulburn or the lakes. There's a multitude of areas that you can go to and have a real lot of fun. Hope you've enjoyed it. I look forward to catching you on the fly.